So let's talk about that success metric, the engagement, the buying, the evangelism, and the loyalty. Those metrics, the success metrics, are going to tell you the people that are following you, sticking with you, purchasing from you, and helping amplify your brand, which is essentially them kind of helping you be kind of a social media manager on your behalf as well, which is great. So then you've really got some exceptional returns on your social media efforts and hopefully some ROI as well from that. So how do we look at these success metrics? There are many ways. And like I said, I'm going to talk about the free ones today because those are the best ones, especially to get started with. So how many of you are using Google Analytics? Awesome. And how many of you are checking that also on a, say, weekly basis? Yeah. OK, great. So any of you that do not have Google Analytics set up yet, that's the first thing I want you to do when you leave this session, or even now. Go ahead. <laughs> Tweet a reminder to yourself. But make sure you're set up on Google. Tie your web page to it. Get yourselves the Google Analytics number. And if you don't know how to, send that immediately over to your web developer to get embedded into your website. From there, you will start to have access to all kinds of amazing information about your web page. So it's very easy to do. If you have a Gmail account, you just go to google.com analytics, sign in, assign your website, and get things rolling. So that's, that's what you want to do first and foremost. 